Okay, you know, I can be prone to hyperbole every now and then. Sometimes I say this is the greatest thing ever or this is the worst thing ever. I think this is the dumbest thing ever. I think we saw the dumbest play. We have found it, and this is what it is. So it, the camera cuts to these two guys talking, and we're thinking, wait a second, why are there two guys near the kickoff? Isn't there just usually one guy who does the kickoff in this scenario? Well, it's Wendy, which, okay, if it's Wendy and the ball's falling down, no worries. You just have another guy go over and he holds it. But keep in mind, with the new kickoff rules, you can't have somebody all the way back there. They need to be a lot closer to the opponent's end zone, meaning this is how they have to do it, where they have to have a guy who's there and then the second the ball is kicked, he just, like, jogs off the field, essentially. Okay, I guess, I mean, logically it makes sense. It's just kind of funny. But even that, okay, this is the first time we've seen this happen, so that alone is already kind of funny. But just to add to the humor, we then are going to see that one the Bears player is returning to kick. He just falls over his own two feet and then gets tackled at a 20-yard line. So, yeah, um, the, you know, the new kickoff rules have, have, have some kinks in them, I think it's fair to say. Still figuring it out.